okay this is the diffuse light which you uh, see here and this is the ambient light which uh, which is here okay uh, to make a color you can enable the color material so gl enable gl color material okay this will enable the color according to the so it will create a materi material according to the color which we give by the gl color free f right here although if we don't enable that function uh, we have to uh, there then this color has no effect at all uh, we need to create a material in this way uh, in that case so I just delete it and uh, I just want to show you how you can create a material for now we just use one material so we use the GL material 3F and we can delete the colors of the cube okay delete the color we do not need that anymore if we use lighting so similarly to lighting we need to give vectors to the GL material 3F so GL material 3F this is the color half the surface so half the mesh is react to the light basically that's what it tells so half does the ambient diffuse and spec and half does this uh, so for the specular okay so i make a float array called diffuse ambient uh, because it will be the same and this will be the actual color of of the material so what color do you give for example make it uh, reddish and give a little green and a little blue too okay so that's uh, we create an amb uh, so we create a color and now we only need to put to this material so the first uh, parameter is what part uh, so what side of the of the mm, primitive do we want to modify this can be uh, front back and front and back because uh, OpenGL handle the front and the back of one face differently so GL uh, front and back so we modify both two uh, side of the primitive the next is what uh, property do you want to modify this is the GL diffuse and ambient we modify at once uh, although you can create with GL diffuse and then use the GL uh, ambient so we just use the diff amp array in here so if everything goes well oh sorry about that I get two errors so GL diffuse and ambient there is no such thing because this should be the uh, GL ambient and diffuse okay and the name of the function is GL material FV because we want to give a vector which contain floats uh, we don't give the number of them so GL uh, ambient and diffuse okay and now we can compile the program and run it and as you can see it gets the color which we uh, use uh, so basically the same effect although we just we have just the same color obviously you can give different materials for for different faces even for the front and the back face differently you can handle uh, yes 
uh, that's about it similarly to the color once you create it uh, why you don't change it everything will be uh, created with uh, this material the gl color material which we enable here so this will actually create a material from the color although in case of material you have a little more uh, possible to change things like you can change the shininess of the material you use the G gl material f and uh, uh, and this parameter will be GL uh, shininess, I think. So, and you give an amount from 0 to 128. Okay. I think nothing else remains. Uh, thank you for watching and have a great day.